One sign that loudly screams that it's your season to get back what you've lost is new chances and opportunities. You will begin to notice that new chances are springing up for you. These opportunities are opportunities that are channels for you to restore things that you've lost. One way to know that it's your season of restoration is the occurrence of chances and opportunities around you. When God wants to promote us and restore the things which we have lost, He usually does it by giving us opportunities to grow and perform better. He may be putting you in a relationship with someone who can help you get better in your career or business. He may also be bringing new opportunities that you've never thought of before. For example, if you've just been scammed by a big investment scheme, God may bring a steady and legitimate investment plan that will restore your loss over time. It is through opportunities and connections that people get to make progress in life. So God will make several opportunities spring up for you out of nowhere. Places where you thought you had no hope will call for massive opportunities. You will be called upon. You will even be called upon in places where you've thought that you couldn't get a contract because you know nobody. Connections will begin to arise for you to build and regain all that you've lost. People would be calling you for services they never demanded from you before. They'll be making inquiries and placing massive orders in your business or whatever it is that you're doing. If these are present in your life, it's because God is saying that it's your season of restoration. He is bringing back all that you've lost, and He's opening doors to usher you into the great season. All you need to do is to step into the place He's opened for you. When unexpected opportunities come your way, it's God showing you little tips of the iceberg before He brings forth His great plan for restoring your loss. Just have faith to receive what He has for you. This is God's way of showing you that He's actively working on your case. There will be an increase in the provisions that are coming your way. If you've been searching for opportunities to gain back what was yours in any area, be it in your career, business, or education, and God is bringing connections and opportunities your way, then it's your season for restoration. You would be massively encountering ways to make gains. It's in God's character to make ways and provide a solution whenever things seem to be going in a horrible direction. In Isaiah 43 verse 19, God says, quote, Behold, I am doing a new thing. Now it springs forth. Do you not perceive and know it, and will you not give heed to it? I will even make a way in the wilderness and rivers in the desert, end quote. It's our God who also made a clear path in the Red Sea for the Israelites to pass through. God will be making ways that were unexpected and unusual to what you've been experiencing, because it's your season for restoration. When God wants to restore all that was formerly yours back to you, He would separate and single you out for great favors in the sight of men. You'll notice bigger favors than you used to have before. Several people would want your services and would be willing to pay you bountifully for it. The favor you're receiving from men will be bringing several multiplications and restorations your way. You'll notice that you're surrounded by God's favor all around. And even when you go in search of opportunities, people would be willing to hand them over to you without stress. People around you would be interested in what you're doing and would even want to sponsor your business or career. This is God's remembrance shining upon you. You're His child, and He will continue to favor you in His sight and the sight of man. If you're experiencing favor, it's because God is bringing restoration your way. Because you're on the edge of getting back all that you've lost, the favors will be unending and you won't be able to deny it. Pay attention to this sign because it is God showing you that He's bringing back all that you've lost. The favor around you would be so increased that people around you will begin to testify about it. If you're experiencing this sort of thing or you've experienced a period of loss, rejection, and disappointments, then it's your season for restoration. Remember that weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. 
As children of God, the Bible has declared that you will be extremely favored everywhere that you go. Proverbs 3 verse 4 says, quote, So you will find favor and success in the sight of God and man. End quote. This is God's heart towards the believer. You're already favored in His sight, and He's telling you that you will experience favor in the sight of men. You may notice that as you're going about searching for opportunities for success and growth, people around you are attracted to your hard work and are interested in blessing you or sponsoring your business. This is because your season of restoration is coming. When it's your season of restoration, God could send His word to you. He may decide to send His direct word to you. This word is a way of comforting you and putting your heart to rest about your loss. God may clearly show you His plans to restore all that you've lost back to you abundantly through a vision or a dream. He can also show you His plans through the scriptures. The scriptures are God's holy map and it is how God shows us what to do. You may have a recurring verse or promise of God echoing in your head over time over and over again. This is God's assurance and confirmation for the season He's bringing your way. If this is happening, then it's God's way of telling you that it's your season of restoration. God could also send you His word through your pastor or the spiritual leader He has placed over you, such that they come to express God's heart's desire to restore all that you've lost back to you. God can also send His word to you by pointing you to the other people around you whom He has helped after they went through great losses in their lives. He does this so that you know that He's still in the business of helping people after they've experienced huge life-changing losses. If you notice any of these, it's because it's your season of restoration. Don't be insensitive to God's words toward you. The fourth sign that God is saying that it's your season of restoration is that people will begin to contact you. All those who have left you for a while will suddenly begin to surface back into your life. Those who ought to have been your source of success but abandoned you in the past will begin to call on you and offer to help you. The way God has always been working with human beings is through other men. God always sends men to help people in time of need. When there may have been times when people rejected you and didn't help you, or they pretended they didn't have the power to do anything for you, God will move them to show up for you in marvelous ways and manners. These people will begin to call you and ask if there's anything they could do for you. They will connect you to the right set of people and help you out of the loss that you may have experienced. If you're experiencing such at the moment, then your season of restoration is on its way. Rejoice, for your time is here. These four signs show you that it's your season of restoration. Are any of these signs present in your life at the moment? Have you lost anything and are hoping for God to restore it? If yes, just observe and check if any of these signs are in your life at the moment. If they are, then rejoice. Your restoration is here.